dog right here just ate half of the donuts that I bought. Good morning guys, so I am currently on my way to pick up Parker and don't worry because I'm not even looking at you guys and I still have both my hands on the wheel. We need to get a car tripod. Anyways, I wanted to give you guys a little life update. I feel like I haven't like vlogged by myself like I used to and just like talked to you guys about life for so long just because usually it's like Parker and I together like showing you just whatever we're doing. But so many like big things are happening. I like already tried to record this and I was like, wow, I just talked way too much. None of that made any sense. So I started the vlog over for the day. I'm currently in the process of re-signing with my YouTube network, which doesn't seem like it would be super stressful, but just like contracts and like legal stuff, like you just always wanna make sure that you're not getting like, you know, ripped off or whatever. So that's happening. What else is happening? Um, we're doing a lot of like wedding planning stuff. I feel like we, I don't even know like we have all the big wedding stuff planned out so i'm not really stressed about that there's just like little things we need to like put together just like figuring out exactly what we want the table to look like so we still have like a decent amount of wedding planning to do but it's just like all the small stuff so i'm not really stressed about that because i know that we can get it done like in the amount of time that we have and what else is going on our house they've like officially finally started i think we showed you guys they're supposed to pour our concrete like sometime soon and then get started like with everything and it's supposed to be done around the time of our wedding. So worst case scenario, we just like live at my house or something for like a week or two, which kind of would suck, but like, you know, there's nothing we can do about it. I'm so excited for that. I have so many like ideas for videos and decorating and all this stuff. And I just like, it's like a month and a half away and that seems so long. Lately with my videos, I have been like, I don't even know what to do and this is not turning out as cute as I wanted to so I'm really excited to move and just like have a fresh space to like film in because I have been living in my house for like 10 years and I love living at home but like obviously there just comes a point when like you are like grown up and I'm getting married so obviously I'm like ready to move out but I'm so excited to move and to decorate and to just like have a fresh start and a fresh place to film because every video that I film right now I'm like this is just not what I pictured this looking like so that's been kind of frustrating so I've been like not lazy with my videos but I've just been procrastinating them and I still get them done like every week on time but like I want to have like this plan I have this plan in my mind mostly for like when we move so it's just basically just like a schedule is what I mean by plan but like I have not been following that right now it's like I film everything like the day before it needs to go up and then I just edit for like an entire day and then get the video up but that's not really how like I want to do it so I'm just really really excited to move I feel like I'm just saying a bunch of like random stuff right now so hopefully this even makes sense anyways I'm going to pick up Parker we're gonna run some errands we have to go to the donut place oh I didn't even like talk about what we're doing today we are going to California today where we have not been for like a really, really long time. I'm gonna shoot something with Awesomeness TV and then I'm also filming a collab with Alicia which is gonna be really fun, she's super nice. So I'm really, really, really excited for that. Usually when I'm in the car and like Parker's driving, I take that as time to like answer business emails and stuff because it's like, what else am I gonna do in the car? So I'm gonna make him drive and I'm gonna sit over here. Anyways. This is a really long video of just me talking about a bunch of random stuff, so. Guys, Target has the cutest decor right now. Like, so much cute stuff. Let me show you. These are like the cutest tables ever. Yeah. This thing is cute. This is cute. These are cute. These are cute pillows. That's a cute mirror. These are cute. This is cute. I have one of these blankets I'm buying. This is a cute pillow. Those are cute lamps. This thing is cute. This thing is cute. These are cute. This is cute. Did you show these cute? Animals? This is all so cute. This is why I need my house to be done right now. Wait, did you say I'm so cute? No. Oh, never mind. I was happy for a second. I thought you were complimenting me. Look how cute that is. Mm, I don't like those animals. Yeah, we're gonna have like big old deers and stuff on our walls. No. Um, okay, so what the heck you naughty little dog this little dog right here just ate half of the donuts that I bought so I think the video that I'm doing with Alicia is like Tumblr inspired fall activities and ideas like things like that 
So I was gonna show you guys like a little DIY donut recipe, but I haven't had time to like make the donuts before we go film. So I just got some that are like gonna look similar that I was gonna use as like props. No, bad dog. So I was just gonna take these ones, film clips of those, and then I'll actually like show you guys how to make some that are similar to that. So I had these, I was trying to figure out which size of plate I wanted to use. So I just had the donuts like sitting out in the open cause they're not actually gonna get eaten. They're just like prop donuts. So I had five of them. I had them just sitting out in the open, like on these plates, figuring out what to do. I was upstairs. The dog ate my donuts. I came in here and like I had, I think, four donuts on this plate and one donut on this one. And I came in here and there was only three donuts right here. And I was like, what the heck? Did I eat the donuts and forget? But no, you ate them. And then she got like crumbs all over my bed. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I just like wiped it off on the floor. There's a plate that I need to take upstairs. That's nasty. That's not old, I swear. You guys can't really see, but now I have like donut crumbs all over the ground. That is something I didn't think about because we don't usually have dogs here. She has cinnamon sugar all over her. They're like cinnamon sugar pumpkin donuts. They're actually like really good, but oh my gosh, you were not supposed to eat those. I don't know what to do, but she's so cute. Oh, you're such a cute little dog. I don't even know what to do. I seriously don't. Like, what if she poops in the house and there's like donuts everywhere and my mom's gone? So I would have to clean it up. So I'm just trying to get some laundry done. I think we're leaving in like an hour and a half. Parker's over there editing the vlog. Also, we just got some not that great news about our house. We thought maybe there would be like a little bit of delay, but like worst case scenario, we would just live at my house for like, you know, a week or so my house instead of Parker's house just cause like I have the basement and his room and like his house, all the bedrooms are right by each other. So we just have more privacy here. That's why we usually hang out here. The 45 days that it takes to build the house starts like later than we thought. They had to delay pouring the concrete and stuff cause it was raining. So they haven't done that yet. So we're trying, we're trying to figure out what to do. Why am I so out of breath? I don't even know. I'm gonna like put the camera right here. Okay, I'm gonna talk to you guys where I do laundry. But yeah, so we're trying to figure out what we want to do. I guess Parker said there's some like apartment places over on like the other side of town that do like month to month rent. And if our house is gonna take, cause it's like 45 business days, which is like Monday through Saturday for them. So if the house is gonna take too long, then we might try and get one of those like little month to month apartment things just for like a month or two. Cause I don't really want to get married and live here. And we already have so much stuff for the wedding planned out. So we're not gonna like move that or anything. And I don't think that will really help either way. So I think we're gonna look into that when we get home just because we're not sure exactly when the house will be done. So as I was telling you guys earlier, there are stressful things happening. I just cannot believe the dog ate my donut. So we are on the road now. We packed, I think I packed like the least stuff that I've ever packed on a trip. I have a ton of like prop type stuff. And then I have like one outfit and that's like pretty much it. I didn't even bring shampoo and conditioner. Hopefully the hotel ones work decent and don't make my hair tangly. But right now, we sadly are at taco time. We didn't have time to like go anywhere healthier before we're yeah, leaving. Yeah, we get some mild sauce? I wanted something healthier for lunch, but we are running late and this is like right next to the freeway. So it was our only option today, but I mean taco time is really good. So like I'm not mad. Thank you. And I had green juice for breakfast. Like that balances out, right? Yeah, that balances out, absolutely. I got the cutest blanket from Target. I'm so excited. They had such cute stuff in there. I just want our house to be done already. I told them that it's gonna be done like later than we thought and that we might get an apartment for like two months. You told them that? Yeah. Yeah, we what might you, have to do that. They're, uh, I think that'd be fun, cause like, I think it would. then we, we, we'll say that we've lived in two different places, you know? We just thought it was a good decision to invest in a house, but we're actually not sure how long we even want to live there. We've talked about moving, I don't know. We can't decide if we would, oh, this battery's gonna die. No. Yeah. We can't decide if we would rather move at some point to Salt Lake, which is where we would kind of both rather move, but since we do YouTube, everything is like based in LA and you guys are gonna be like, you moved to LA and you hated it. Yes, I did. But I think if I was married, I would be fine because- If she had me to drive her all over and- I could not drive there. I had so much stress and anxiety driving there. I literally left my house like twice and I seriously like thought I was gonna die both times. But yeah, I think see. that I think it'd be fun to go experience somewhere new because I definitely, in my life, I wanna live somewhere else. Yeah, but. Me too. I want to like 
be here for kids and like to raise kids and stuff, this is where I'd want to be. Yeah. So we'd have to do it at a younger age. Yeah, maybe sometime within the next year or so we'll move and we could just rent out the house. It'll just be weird to see where we are in a year. Yeah. Because last year, a year ago from now, I was almost gonna make a video about this, but then I decided not to because, I don't know, I just didn't want to, but it was like, I was gonna make a video a couple weeks ago that it was like on the exact day that I like moved home last year, or like the exact day I moved to LA, I don't remember. A lot of you guys are new, so some of you guys might not know, but I did move there last summer. Um, you guys probably know Claudia, I lived with her. Yes, we're still friends, love her, she's super cute, but we lived together for a little bit. And I was planning on being there for like a year, but then before I even left, I knew I wasn't gonna like it. And I just like, I just knew it wasn't right for me. So I was like, maybe I'll be there till like January, just until like the year is up. I'll test it out. I was there for like maybe a month and it was like the worst month of my entire life. I hated it. Did not like living there. I love Claudia. This is obviously like not, oh, I didn't like living with Claudia. Like Claudia was a great roommate. She cleaned up her stuff. She made me sweet potato fries. I just didn't like living there. But I was gonna make a video about how like my life has changed so much and I'm so happy every single day that I moved home because a lot of people gave me a lot of crap for leaving after like literally not even a month. And like not only just like having people online, cause I mean, as much as I love all of you, like I don't really care what the haters say or like whatever, but just like even in like real life, like I have people be like, whoa, like you weren't there for very long. Like why would you move? Like it was a hard decision. And luckily it all worked out. Like with Claudia, she had a new roommate that moved like right in. It was one of our friends. So like that wasn't an issue, but it was hard for me to move home. But I'm so like grateful that I did. Every single day I wake up and I'm so happy that I'm here and not in LA. And like, it's just so exciting. Like how much my life has like turned around since then. Like we're getting married, we're building a house. We've traveled and done so much stuff. I'm just really grateful that I like had the courage to be like I'm leaving. <laughs> you know what I'm grateful for? Me? I'm grateful Tater for you. Talk? Now we're at like 723,000 subscribers. But we just hit 700. Are you serious? Yeah. We just hit 700. We just hit 700 like a couple days ago. But oh my god. Seven over 700,000. I swear we just hit 400,000. I swear we did too, guys. This is awesome. Like honestly. Thank you guys so much. It means so much. Like, I wouldn't be doing this right now if it wasn't for you guys. Update. Hopefully the camera battery doesn't die because this is a good conversation. But for the past month or so, you can tell. I'm sorry, it's your story. So, for the, yeah, for the past about month, I don't know if you guys knew, but I was a bug killer. I was, the, I was a pest control guy. And that's what I was doing for work, just going to school or whatever. And I decided to quit that job and come and work with Aspen. I'm sure you guys have known, we've talked about it before, but I edit all the vlogs and I do all that. Aspen has her main channel and then we have this, so she was just having a hard time taking care of both of them, so I decided, yeah. you know, it I'll come funny. and take on the vlog channel as my job now. So that's what I'm doing as my job. And that's why I'm able to travel and stuff and do all this with Aspen still because I'm not working at my other job anymore. So it got to the point because we were vlogging so much and like I couldn't fully do a vlog channel and a main channel and just like everything else I'm doing. So it got to the point where I was like, okay, I'm either gonna hire somebody and train them to edit, to film me, to do everything that you're already doing or you can do it and he does like get paid because um, he's like working for me. It's mostly like, we don't really call it like working for me, it's like we work together. I got to the point where I was like, I'm gonna hire somebody or you can do it. And if I hire someone, that means you don't travel with me anymore. You don't come on these trips with me because I need somebody who like knows how to do stuff and how to edit and how to take pictures and how to film me and like do all that stuff. So we decided that we would do this. And it's been really, really fun. And I think it's just such a cool experience that like we yeah. get to be so young and we get to like just live our lives this yeah, way. Yeah, it's, it's been, it's been unreal. So we're really grateful for you guys. I feel like we should end this clip before the battery dies, just in case. Okay, bye. Mwah. What's up guys? So we made it to LA and it is now nighttime, dinner time. We're kind of in a weird area, so we didn't really want to like walk anywhere. So we got Postmates and pizza. So this is Parker's pizza slash some of my pizza. Close that. And then I got some veggie grill. Let's see. 
These are like the best cookies ever. Um, I have ketchup. I have mac and cheese. I have some type of quinoa bowl. Sweet potato fries. Alrighty guys, so Aspen I think was ending the vlog before the camera actually died, so I'm gonna finish it off. I just wanna say thank you guys for subscribing. Anyways, I just wanna say thank you guys. Over 700,000 subscribers, that's insane. If you're not subscribed already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We're a lot of fun. We do a lot of fun things. That's it for the vlog today. We will see you guys tomorrow.